giant sunspot currently facing our Earth. It's still growing and is capable of emitting powerful solar flares. A fast-growing giant sunspot can emit solar flares has more than doubled in size in recent days. It's currently facing our Earth, according to astronomers. Sunspots are dark areas of strong magnetic field on the sun's surface. They appear dark because they are much colder than other parts of the sun's surface, having formed at areas where magnetic fields are particularly strong, according to NASA. And because of the strong magnetic field, magnetic pressure increases while surrounding atmospheric pressure decreases, resulting in the lower temperatures. Now, sunspots are also associated with the strong magnetic fields on the sun's surface, and they appear dark because they are much colder than other parts having formed in areas where magnetic fields particularly strong. And because of the strong fields, magnetic pressure increases, surrounding atmospheric pressure decreases, resulting in lower temperatures. Sunspots also associated with eruptive disturbances, such as solar flares, which are fast-moving eruptions of radiation and coronal mass ejection, CMEs, which is when large masses of plasma and highly magnetized particles violently ejected from the sun. Flares move at the speed of light, and take about eight minutes to reach our Earth, while CMEs can take three or four days to reach our Earth. So there's two different types. The flare goes higher. The fast-growing sunspot noted by experts is AR3038. Yesterday they said sunspot AR3038 was big. Today it's enormous. This is what Tony Phillips, author of Space Weather, wrote on Wednesday. He said the fast-growing sunspot has doubled in size in only 24 hours. The expert noted that the magnetic field surrounding AR3038 could potentially blast M-class solar flares or medium-sized flares towards our Earth. And images from NASA's Solar Dynamic Observatory taken June 22nd show the sun with enormous sunspots, with AR3038 looking particularly big after evolving over the past few days. The sunspot doubled in size each day for the past three days, and it's about two and a half times the size of our Earth. This is what C. Alex Young, Associate Director for Science in Heliophysics Science Division at NASA, said. But they said there's no cause for concern. Rob Steenberg, the acting head of National Oceanic Atmospheric Administration, NOAA, Space Weather Forecast Office, said there is no need to panic noting that sunspots naturally grow in size. He says that's what sunspots do. Over time, generally, they'll grow. They go through stages and then they decay, he explains. Young also noted that while the sunspot is producing flares, it does not have the complexity for the largest flares, and there is only a 30% chance that it will create medium-sized flares. The chances it will create large flares are even smaller at 10%, he said. W. Dean Pencel, Project Scientist at Solar Dynamics Observatory, also reassured us there's no need for concern, telling us at the publication that uh, AR3038 is a modest-sized active region that has not grown abnormally rapidly and is still somewhat small in area, he explains. So as of June 22nd, NOAA, Space Weather Prediction, which monitors solar flares, has not issued any warnings for them. But if solar flares, such as an X1-class flare, are released from the sun, they can potentially create disruptions to communication satellites and long-distance cables here on Earth, wreaking havoc with the world's Internet. Another expert is André Munoz Jaramillo. He's a lead scientist at Southwest Research Institute in San Antonio. Also stressed there's no need for concern. He says, I want to emphasize there's no need to panic and that the sunspots will happen. He said, we're prepared and doing everything we can to predict and mitigate their effort, the effects. For the majority of us, we don't need to lose sleep over this, he said. And this is on WND and Zero Hedge. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. Finally, support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.